Guys, welcome back to the channel. S here from S Snags Organo Creations, and I'm here doing a video about this new pyramid. All right, so this here pyramid, you can see see it for what it is. It's a very silvery, blackish pyramid, and I'll tell you what's in it and what what the goal is. Now that tip, if it focuses on the tip, you can see there. So in that tip, the whole silver black tip there, just before the um, quartz crystal there, the whole thing is um, aluminium powder. But it's 50% is shungite powder, okay? So I've I've done a different mix. So this is like an extra shungite sort of pyramid as well. So you've got the organite, which I've used. Um, the metals is the aluminium powder. And it's mixed with shungite a little bit more than what we normally do. So it's extra shungite. All right. So that's the whole tip. Then we go down to a clear layer with a quartz crystal point wrapped on copper wire. Now in there... You've got um, the flower of life symbol. You can see that. You've got selenite sticks going out as well. Um, yeah, you can see how there's all these black dots through there. That's because when you mix, um, the um, you can see all the different granules and all that through it. The aluminium powder with the shungite, like a heavy mix, heavier mix of shungite. That's what happens. Okay. Um, the next layer is a little bit less. It's more aluminium powder, so more of an organite sort of a mix. And then the base is the same as these two up here, okay? So you can sort of see different tones in it. Um, I'll go ahead and show you the bottom. It's just um, black with um, just your functional glitter there for something to look at, okay? Basically, it's a nice looking pyramid, very strong. Um, here doing it with these, um, you know, organite charge plates. You can see, you know, the size if you wanted to. Uh, but yeah, imagine um, taking this and sitting it on top and leaving that somewhere in your house or whatever. That would have some massive vibes. Um, yeah, but very good, very cleansing, very structuring due to the fact that it's, well, it is organite. You've got uh, quartz crystal all through this, like crushed up quartz and crushed up selenite and all of these metal powder layers, and you can actually see it. Um, if it focuses, you can see bits of crystals and that in the tip. It's not going to focus. There's little, little, well, in person you can see there's little bits of um, crystals in that. Can you see the shine of the little shards in there? It's just, it's not focusing, guys, but, yeah, there is crystals all added through in there. All right. So, yeah, just a quick, yeah. Now, let me get into the um, the Nubian pyramids and how it come about and all the rest of them, what they, what they do, what they yeah, just their structure. All right, so Alexander Golov, who is a Russian scientist. Now, he made a 144-foot um, tall Nubian pyramid in this style, this this shape, okay? Now, it's got the pi ratio in it. It's got, you know, some sacred geometry in it. Um, the way that it's steep, like the angles, the steepness of the, um, you know, up to the point, the angles. Um, now, he built this pyramid, and he was getting people to um, come in, sit in there, and they'll have massive healing benefits. I believe they uh, are reducing symptoms of cancer and things like that. Um, so it was structuring water. They did tests. It's all documented. Um, yeah, people were relieving symptoms of major diseases and uh, just coming in there to, yeah, basically get energy healing. And it works, okay? So that was with this style pyramid. So the molds that I have, they're on the golden ratio of that, okay? So these here are the Russian pyramids that uh, he created. Now, um, not only that, around his pyramid that he built, that people were coming in to get healing benefits from, there were flowers popping up all over the place, and um, they got a botanist or someone that specialises in flowering, like flowers, um, yeah, to um, test them and see what they actually were, because no one knew what they were. And they were actually... Um, in fact, have been extinct for thousands of years, you know. But they were somehow, this energy that these here produce, it's like the genetic blueprint of makeup, the creator, the design. It doesn't go away. But if, if there's a, the right energy and the right circumstances, these things can come back, all right? So these flowers that have been extinct for thousands of years started popping up and growing, all right? And that they've also done other stuff where they did a, a modified... Um, um sonar um i think they modified something to test out the energy how far this here stretches like in the atmosphere um they speculate that it's actually healing the ozone layer um 
but they can detect this energy for hundreds of miles out. I forget the, the right specs. You can look into this, so it's Alexander Golov, uh, the Russian pyramid, and uh, this is his specs. So this here, just being in this structure, in this shape, in this steepness, has its own frequency and vibration and healing powers, okay? Mm -hmm. Now we're adding organite to the mix, the metal powders within the, the organic resin. It's technically the resin is an organic substance and um, you've also got shungite all through there and you've got the crystals and the piezoelectric properties of the crystals so your quartz all right so this is loaded with quartz like i said there's crushed up quartz you've got a big terminator piece in there you, and selenite as well selenite sticks and selenite crushed up all in there okay so you've got a lot of things going for this yeah, now this here will grab hold and structure your energy all the negative um, energies it'll grab hold of that and restructure it so it's beneficial pass as it passes through your body, making you feel better, making you more energized, making you um, potentially heal certain diseases, as Wilhelm Reich's um, device did. Um, you know, uh, he, his accumulators, he was relieving symptoms of all sorts of um, illnesses, um, including cancer. So, yeah, good stuff, good stuff. So you got a lot of things going for this. All right, guys, that's it on this. Look into... Alexander Golov and the Russian pyramids and you will see and how's these charge plates as I just uploaded a video of them very happy very excited about them but I'll put this down and um, yeah stay tuned for more videos guys and thanks for watching